What's up, YouTube? Dark God back again. It's been a while. It's been about three months. Last video I dropped was uh, my Oscar predictions, uh, which I did pretty good in, but not that you care. Um, anyway, three months later, dropping another video. Uh, I obviously want to start working on more videos, getting more content out there. And I figured today would be a good day to do that because uh, today something special happened. Today is the release of the Halloween 2018 trailer. Now, my favorite horror film is Halloween the original. Uh, my favorite director is John Carpenter. In fact, you could see my autograph right there. Um, I just love the series. Always did. Um, so I figured I never did a reaction video. And, and what better way to start than with Halloween? A uh, very anticipated horror film for this year. Uh, I actually had a couple good trailers drop. Um, I was thinking about doing it for Suspiria originally. But then I realized the Halloween one was dropping. That would be cool to start with considering that it is my favorite franchise. So anyway, here we go with Halloween 2018. I mean, big and hard that doing an official drop and everything. The one thing I'm not really too much a fan of is that they eliminated all the canon of two on. You know, Michael Myers only killed three people in their their canon now, which isn't. Um, he could have gotten rid of the later films, but two could have stayed. Like that they're using the music. It feels like they're going like a little supernatural. With, not supernatural, but like that there's something there that, you know, showing the mask, all the other inmates going crazy. I mean, it has to take place at Halloween, obviously. She was almost murdered. Wasn't it her brother who murdered all those babies? Yeah. Showing the scar is pretty cool. That's something that people made up. Do you know that I pray every night that yeah. you escape? Forty years, and I mean, what would you do that for? Jamie's still. So I mean, she's looking her age, but forty years <laughs> later, not too bad. Executive producer John Carpenter. They just show Michael without his mask. I just hope that was another inmate. Excuse me, somebody's in here. Hello? It's funny because it looks like they're taking a lot of teeth. And he has his mask. It's waiting for this night. another trailer by mistake so I kind of like it one thing Halloween series is good at and it looks like that they're maintaining here is they do a lot of scenes in the daylight that was always something like the later films you know they show Halloween usually like they'll build up through the day they'll show the kids right out of school and even the original like part two is the only one that I really remember that's like all at night obviously because the continuation of the first one but like the other ones, even four, five, and six, there's a lot of scenes in the daylight, which I, th I think is cool that you don't see a lot of daylight scenes in horror movies, um, especially scenes where, where somebody's being killed by a, you know the slasher in it and everything. Um, it does have kind of the feel of the original. Um, the one thing I, I, I mean, obviously John Carpenter would have to do it more, but the one thing was the way the way the original was filmed. There was always like these big shots, and that's a John Carpenter thing. Like he always has like you, you see a lot of background and this is very close and everything and uh jamie being like the survivalist i mean that's that would just be the natural progression of a character i would imagine like surviving that you'd be prepared preparing yourself for him ever getting back out so that kind of does make sense and everything um 
it's gonna be interesting. I like that last scene with the the boogeyman in in the the closet door and everything. But like, um, the only thing I don't want them to do is I don't want them to like go like the the present style of a slasher movie and just have a body count to have a body count. I mean, uh, you know, like the the quality over quantity might you know be better in it. But um, I mean, with John Carpenter on, with Bloomhouse on, I mean, it just you're you're hoping for something. I mean, I didn't hate the Rob Zombie remake. The first one, I, I hated the second one. The second one was terrible, but I didn't hate the first one. I mean, I don't think it's anywhere close to the original. But, I mean, the Halloween franchise is just something like, I mean, there's really three iconic franchises when it comes to horror, obviously. Halloween, uh, Friday the 13th, and Nightmare on Elm Street, I would say. And um, Halloween is kind of one that's been bastardized. Like, the, the later films were okay, not the best, not really that good either, but after the remakes it just kind of it's nice to get a fresh start i mean i i don't like that they're getting rid of the canon of all that stuff but it, it is something cool to that we're getting something back to the original what it seems like so um october 19th uh i'm already going to make sure that i'm going to see that uh when it's released i know my wife will want to see that too she's a big halloween fan so until then hopefully um this isn't uh like a one spot video hopefully there's more but until then i catch you on the flip side